Hello everybody, welcome back to another Midjourney version 5 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create a logo in Midjourney and then more importantly, I'm going to show you how to turn it into vector art and turning it into vector art for free. There's no charge on this. You literally, in the next two minutes, you're going to become the best logo designer, the best logo creator you know. Let's get started. First step, go into Midjourney as you see I'm in here in the Midjourney bot forward slash imagine and then copy in what you want your logo to be. It can be anything. The only thing I recommend is using white background. And the reason why it's easier to remove the background when it's in white as opposed to a gradient. Anyways, I published that, I punched that in. I'm gonna let it run when it come, when it's done. We're gonna come back and we're gonna take it to the next step. All right, it's done, welcome back. So if I just click on this image here, this grid of four, you'll see here that it gave me four different cracks at it. I quite like all of them, but the top right one really appeals to me. So what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna click on this U2, which means up sample or upscale two. And by the way, if I wanna create variations, I can click on V2 or V anything, and it allows me to go ahead and remix it. So if I wanted it to have a, instead of flat 2D, I could do flat 3D, for example, and click submit, and then it will rerun it for me. So it's a little bit outside the scope of this tutorial, but I wanted to show you that technique. Okay, so we've got the image or we've got the, what we want here. We wanna turn it into a vector art logo. How do I do it? I'm going to right click on this image and I'm gonna to go to save image. When I save it, I'm just gonna save it to my desktop and then bang, there we go, I've saved it. The next step is I'm gonna to go to my browser and you're gonna already see here that I've done it once already, but I'll do it again. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna to go to vectorizer.ai, the link will be in the description below, and I'm gonna go into Finder now, and I'm gonna grab that image we just made and downloaded from Midjourney. I'm going to drag and drop it right here, and then it's in vectorizer.ai, and then very simple. Here's the original image, here is the vectorized result. So this is the vector. Now I'm gonna go ahead and click on Download, and when I do that, you're gonna see here at the bottom that it says dot, 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 SVG. That means scalable vector graphic. Now I'm gonna go ahead and show it in Finder. And I'm gonna go ahead now, I'm just gonna right click on it and I'm gonna open it with Adobe Illustrator. And the reason why I did that is because this way, when I click on it, I'm just gonna zoom in here, pardon me. When I click on it, you'll see here that this is vector. So there you go. This is how we create amazing vector art, vector logos in under two minutes. Thanks for watching.